traffic, whether it's pedestrian traffic or vehicle traffic, some of the main responsibility is getting them into the stadium and getting them out away from the stadium after the game. There's also a lot of air traffic that comes in for the bigger games like LSU and when we play, say, Texas A&M, and they'll be covered up at the airport. And that also plays a role with us, you know, especially after the game if we're out trying to look at our traffic on the ground and then we've got all these, you know, different airplanes leaving the airport and that comes, becomes a safety factor for us. On game day, we, uh, we're in constant communication with TPD's helicopter. Um, they're checking different routes, making sure the traffic is flowing appropriately. We also have signal operations um, to keep traffic flowing inbound pre-game and outbound during post-game. The most important thing for us, obviously, is fan safety. And it's important that we look at every possible area of vulnerability. So we coordinate with all the local agencies, Northport Police Department, Tuscaloosa County Sheriff's Office, obviously all of UAPD, Tuscaloosa Fire Rescue Service, and North Star Ambulance. We involve all of our federal partners, ATF, FBI, Homeland Security as well, and everybody has a little bit different mission. As far as the university goes, we have six canines, and on a game day we'll start anywhere from 3 a.m. to 5 a.m. in the morning. The dogs are looking for explosives to ensure that nothing is being introduced to our environment that we can't find throughout the day on Saturday. Tuscaloosa Fire Rescue Service and North Star Ambulance. If we didn't have those folks around on game days, especially in the hotter months when there's a lot of heat related issues and things like that, it'd be terrible. So again, if we can help them and maybe avoid that trip to the hospital, allow them to go cool off and get back into the game, that's, that's a big deal. Well, this is our first aid room for the stadium. And the general purpose is obviously to provide first aid. Uh, we certainly take care of some uh, serious uh, medical emergencies here, but we try to get those patients uh, out of here uh, fairly quickly to the emergency department. But on a normal day, we'll have um, you know multiple ambulances stationed here at the stadium. And also Tuscaloosa Fire and Rescue Service will also augment North Star's um, response. So we have uh, multiple ambulances here that we can uh, arrange to get those patients out of this uh, first aid uh, room and over to the hospital. Depending on the severity of the call, uh, sometimes we might triage in, like, in our location, uh, find a cooling fan, cool them off, ice packs, whatever we need to do. Uh, if it needs further attention, we'll take them downstairs to the first aid room at uh, gate nine. And if they need additional uh, treatment, we can actually go to the hospital and have the North Star paramedic services pick us up from there and take us to the hospital. Our main purpose is safety. That is the, the single most important thing that we do on a game day or any event on this campus. Um, we are law enforcement officers with state jurisdiction, but that is secondary. Our primary is just keeping people safe. We're gonna be there early in the morning and we're not gonna be gone until the game is over and all the fans have safely gotten off campus. It's the people that are out there, it's my team, and the public safety team that get out there and make it safe. All of our partners, I, I just I can't tell you how amazing they are. For the fans, you know, for, for the staff, faculty, whoever, parents, visitors, anybody on this on this campus all the time, it's uh, it's vital and they keep us they keep us safe.